Right, so we've left, left the hills for now. Quantock Commons, SSSSI, no unauthorised vehicles. Quantock Common. These green flies. I seen a deer a minute ago. It was just, it was a big, quite a big deer. Um, walking gently through the wood, but by the time I got the camera organised, it, it didn't rush off, but it disappeared. By the time I got the camera plugged in, um, plugged out. Now this, if you follow this track up here, this takes you on the Coleridge Walk, by the way. If you go up there, I've done that. If I'd carried on the Coleridge Walk earlier, where I was quite a way back, I would have come out here. But I wanted to go cross country. I wanted to find out um, exactly what's up there, which is what I've done. That's the Coleridge feather, look. They used to write with feathers, didn't they? That's the symbol. So, like I said, that takes you up there. We're now going to walk. When I say we, I'm referring to people watching with me. All right, I'm not schizophrenic. I had to point that out to somebody once. She said, you're always talking to we. I said, yeah, but I'm talking to the audience. I'm taking you on a journey. So it's like you and me. We'll be going past Alf Oxen House. It might have a different name now, of course. And I've got a feeling it was being done up. And it could be like a hotel again. Which would be good. The ghosts of Wordsworth and Coleridge will be happy. Rather than it, you know, rotting away up there. But of course, I've seen a lot of it when it was not in a terrible state. In fact, my sister Margaret, I think she did the curtains for that place. And maybe some of the upholstery. But um, I, when I managed to have a roam round it, it was empty. And I even got on part of the roof. But all that, you can't do that now. No. So I'm having a beautiful day today. I've done a, a massive walk up and down hills in the heat. Exploring. And I said, and I was saying earlier to myself, it would be nice to be able to like now even, because it's only, it's early still, to be able to go up Colford Glen now to capture the deer drinking out of the stream. It would be so peaceful up there now. So gentle. But of course I know mountain bikers and that get up there more now. It's not as peaceful as it was. Not really. Now I can, we're just coming into the walled garden. There's a few of it coming in there. Hold on. I'm just wondering whether that's been, um, that's the walled garden. There's a gateway into it there. All these big mansions in the past had walled gardens where they grew all their own crops. And everything. I went in there, um, I just wondered if it had been done up at all yet. I might be tempted to wander in there again and have a look. Because it might still be derelict. Although it does look very white. I wonder if they've rendered the wall. There's a car there. We're coming up to the... There's like a barn that's been converted and it has been used for business. Now there's some very old trees there. See those trees there? I wouldn't be at all surprised if um, they weren't there when Wordsworth and Coleridge were here. They would have had this view of the hills, by the way. Whether it would be all agricultural then, I don't know. We might, there is a car there, but it doesn't mean we can't just go and have a look in the garden. We'll see if we can get round the back in a minute. Yeah. Wordsworth Cottage. I'm glad I've come back this way. 
sort of completes the walk really coming this way doesn't it and when because when Georgia and I came up here further down there we saw a, a whole field of um, deer those trees are magnificent aren't they I said they could have been here when Wordsworth was there. Could have been smaller, of course. And this tree I'm under, maybe. I'm not so sure about these. I don't know, are they 200 years old? Any oak standing, like them in there. That oak over there, for example, that would have been here. There's the old barn. It doesn't look any different to me. Be quite honest. Don't look no different. And that, I wonder if that's still occupied at all. Something's got a swing there. We'll just branch off here. There's the house, anyway, where Wordsworth lived. Still looks a bit derelict on the top, doesn't it? Even that looks a bit. Doesn't look totally um. Got dust been out. been up there and it just zoom in on that that metal staircase up there look I've been up there I got right on the top of the roof once right we'll just sneak around here a minute See if the ward garden is still um, not used. Right, we'll go around here. Those trees, very pretty, aren't they? 